Christophe Galtier's Saint Etienne hosted Lyon at Stade Geoffroy Guichard for a fiery derby full of promise. In case of a win, Le Vert could go within one point of Lyon, currently in fourth. Lyon had lost three of the last four, including being knocked out of the French Cup by Marseille. Saint Etienne had also been knocked out of the Cup, but had picked up seven out of the nine points on offer during their last three league matches. The atmosphere at Geoffroy Guichard was incredible. Saint-Étienne started on the front foot. They hounded Lyon defensively and forced mistakes. Emmanuel Mamana lost the ball and Henri Saive played in Kevin Munipake who did the rest with a shot through Anthony Lopez's legs. Saint-Étienne 1-0 to the good after just nine minutes. Good pass by Saive, Munipake picks it up and he only had one thing on his mind. Lyon completely overrun in the early minutes of the match, 22nd minute. New signing Memphis Depay lose the ball. Alexander Sodelin played in a wonderful pass to Romain Hamumo, rounded Lopez and gave Lever a two-goal cushion. And if things carried on that way for Lyon, it would be a very, very long night indeed for Bruno Genesio's men. Two 0 at half time for Saint Etienne. Lyon didn't show up at all during the first 45 minutes. So far, it's a perfect game plan for Galtier. Lyon came out with more grit and determination in the second half. And the first chance of that half went to Rashid Gezal, who had a glorious chance to pull one goal back. But Jesse Moulin saved. Gezal should have done better with this. Straight at the Santa Chen goalkeeper. A few minutes later, almost the same move saw Depay go one on one with Moulin. But the Dutch striker wasn't accurate enough. And that capped a poor performance from him all round. The game then spiralled out of control. In extra time, Gezal was shown a second yellow for a clash with Fabien Lemoyne, who had just come on a few minutes earlier. A seemingly harsh decision from the referee, especially in the 92nd minute. A minute later, though, Corentin Saliza went flying in with a dangerous tackle on Lemoyne and was shown a straight red by the referee as the players were pulled apart from each other. A fiery derby right till the very end. From a football point of view, a great night for Satichen, who record a famous 2-0 victory over their bitter rivals and go to within one point of Lyon. Bruno Genesio's men, however, suffered their third consecutive defeat and now have two players suspended for next week's matches.